everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. So following in the footsteps of his brother, former UFC lightweight champion Anthony Showtime Pettis, here is one of the best flyweights in the world, Sergio Pettis, comes in tonight riding a nice winning streak, Joe, and really a guy who much was expected of from the minute he stepped foot inside the octagon and largely Sergio has not disappointed. I think in a lot of respects, if anything, he's over at cheap. This guy has outstanding defense. And having that type of skill, knowing that you can protect yourself and yet still land devastating blows of your own, it is a distinct advantage. So here is one of the all-time great lightweights in the history of the UFC, Khabib the Eagle Nurmagomedov, longtime training at American Kickboxing Academy in Northern California from Dagestan, Russia. And a guy who it took a while for him to realize a UFC championship opportunity for Khabib Nurmagomedov. This is a decorated fighter, wrestler, grappler, who brings so much to the table. The Sambo master, Khabib Nurmagomedov. This guy has some of the best guard passing in all of mixed martial arts. His technique and the speed of his execution is outstanding. Or till the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Pettis is 24. Nurmagomedov is 29. He will have a one-inch reach advantage. Now to get us started, the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. Structures to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go down right now. And we are underway. All right, Joe, here we go, round one. There is Sergio Pettis. First amateur fight at 15 years old against a 22-year-old Ended with a first round head kick knockout. Majority of his wins in the UFC have been by decision. A finish undeniably would be useful for the Phenom Sergio Pettis. Oh! oh huge right hand! hand! He's in trouble right now. Just missed with the left there. Takedown defense holds up. Agomedov gets in the clinch. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. First takedown attempt is there. And Dizzy as he looks to improve position here. Look at that. Nice. Working for the Americana. 
He's got that arm secured. He's got the elbow to the body. Very close here. Look at this, though. Oh! Oh! This is not good at all. Just absolutely is. incredible. Beautiful technique setting it up and a beautiful job in getting that submission. Yeah, that is high level stuff out of him there, Joe, to finish the submission. It's one thing to get the dominant position, it's another thing to close the show, and he certainly did that here tonight. That's a big one. And here's the end. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And here we see it again, beautiful submission victory. So a seminal moment for him here tonight, Joe Rogan, as he gets the win by way of submission. Certainly one of the bigger wins of his career and as big a statement as he could have made here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 19 seconds of the very first round. For the winner, by submission, Habib the Eagle well, it's becoming a pretty common visual inside that octagon as Khabib Nurmagomedov gets his hand raised yet again here tonight. And when the injuries and the weight cutting issues aren't part of the narrative... Thank you for watching. Please wait for more videos. See you soon. He looks the part of the best lightweight in the world. A lot of